Hello and welcome back to the next installment of the Surf Miner Guide to Server Success. The last couple of videos have been aimed at getting your server out there through advertising, but today's episode is going to be entirely different, as we're going to be talking about customizing your server with plugins. In the introductory episode I told you that you should have an aim for what you want your server to be and that Minecraft can be a whole lot more than just survival or creative mode. This is where plugins and mods come in. However, there's an essential difference between mods and plugins that you should be aware of. Mods are big modifications of Minecraft which contain new game mechanics, models and sounds. Your server will need to run Forge to support mods and the client has to install them on their local version as well. Plugins, on the other hand, are smaller alterations of how Minecraft works but can have a big impact. You will need Bucket or a server that supports Bucket plugins, Spigot for example, to run them and your players can connect to your server using an unmodded client. As plugins are by far the most used type of modifications on bigger servers, we will be covering them for the rest of this video. Plugins can be used to do almost anything, from adding new game modes to managing multiple worlds and from adding new boss enemies to adding new commands. There's all sorts of plugins available to suit your needs. However, you will have to pick which plugins you want on your server. To find plugins that suit your needs, take a look around the Bucket forums or the Bucket Dev website. Links will be in the description. We also have some videos covering various plugins on the Surfminer channel. Check out the top 5 series for example. Once you picked what plugins you want on your server, you can install them. We have a tutorial on plugin installation on our channel as well. As expected, the more plugins you are running on your server, the more resources you will need. So make sure that your server is running smoothly after you installed your plugins. Plugins can be a powerful tool to make your server unique. You can mix and match most plugins so you have a near infinite amount of possibilities for your server. For example, you can add new game modes, enemies and game mechanics at the same time easily. Plugins can also be used as a reward for donating, as we will discuss later on in this series. Make sure to clearly advertise what plugins you are running if you are advertising on forums or voting sites. This will make sure that players know what they can expect when they connect to your server. That's it for this time. It's a bit hard to cover all aspects of plugins in one short video, so make sure to share your tips and favorite plugins in the comments below. Thank you very much for watching and don't forget to get your server cheap at surfminer.com.